Undoubtedly, the antiquated petroleum-powered engines in our cars are bound to be replaced, but what will take their place as a successor? The answer remains a clash that still remains unresolved to this day. H2 vehicles or hydrogen-powered vehicles present a fascinating alternative to traditional gasoline and electric-powered vehicles and are destined for greatness in the long run. Being regarded as an alternative that holds the most promising results for the future. So today, in this video we'll be going through the latest advancements that have recently been made in the field of hydrogen-powered cars. The automotive sector is at a crucial phase in history, and there's no denying that. Consequently, the idea of our cars emitting nothing other than steam no longer seems to be a fairy tale. Similarly, the platform of hydrogen-powered cars seems to be gaining its audience, being deemed as a feasible choice for commercial travel. As of now, hydrogen cars have come a long way since the 1980s, and without further ado, let's look at the latest advancements that have been made to these hydrogen cars. It's important to understand why hydrogen was presented as an alternative fuel in the first place and why it holds so much promise for saving our planet in order to fully broaden your viewpoint on these revolutionary vehicles. Hydrogen is deemed to be an ideal fuel choice for the future due to it being clean, flexible, and energy efficient while also possessing the ability to emit nothing but water, travel an outstanding amount of distance on a single fuel cell, and mimic the antiquated petrol-powered cars. Hydrogen offers a balance between EVs and gasoline vehicles, providing clean energy without compromising range or refueling convenience where its alternatives linger behind. Now, moving on to the latest advancements. Hydrogen has made quite an appearance at the latest Consumer Electronics Show 2024, or CES 2024 for short, that was held recently in Las Vegas, and this is mainly due to the publicity done by two large automotive companies which are Hyundai and Bosch Mobility. Hyundai unveiled its ambitious intentions to use hydrogen energy at the massive Tech & Gadget Expo in Las Vegas. By advancing energy generation, storage, and transportation, the South Korean automotive manufacturer hopes to create a hydrogen society in addition to fuel cell vehicles. While the technology is already practicable, Jose Munoz, president and worldwide chief operating officer of Hyundai Motor Corps, projected on Monday that it will soon become economically viable as well. In a related development, Bosch Mobility declared at CES 2024 that it will introduce its first hydrogen combustion engine this year, which will significantly lower the amount of carbon emissions caused by humans worldwide. Substantial investments, like the $7 billion the U.S. government is spending on the development of hydrogen infrastructure, have inspired Hyundai and Bosch to move forward with their projects. Moreover, the notorious Elon Musk, who also happens to be the owner of Tesla, has recently focused on hydrogen-powered vehicles. According to independent design engineer Cosmin Ispas, the first Tesla model to utilize hydrogen fuel will be named the Model H. Although Elon Musk has been dubious about hydrogen, comparing fuel cells to fool cells and characterizing them as mind-bogglingly stupid, his position appeared to change when he said in a tweet on April 1, 2022, that he will be switching to hydrogen by 2024. This may seem like an April Fool's hoax, but it's still interesting to think that Tesla would embrace hydrogen. Likewise, Toyota has decided that it's time to transform the electric vehicle market by introducing a new hydrogen-powered car that will render EVs obsolete. The CEO of Toyota has declared that this cutting-edge hydrogen vehicle will rule the auto industry. Toyota has a long history in the hydrogen vehicle market. They began working on hydrogen-powered cars in 1992 and created their first fuel cell electric vehicle, FCEV, in 1996, utilizing a prototype from the first-generation Toyota RAV4. In 2015, Toyota unveiled the first-generation Mirai, the world's first commercially available hydrogen-powered car following decades of development. In addition to this, Toyota reveals its plans with the newly found hydrogen-powered cars, stating that, Toyota is counting on the expansion of hydrogen, not just in the car industry, but in all industry and commercial spheres. 
Moving on, in order to power a new plug-in hybrid fuel cell version of Honda's CRV, General Motors and Honda, both automakers, have begun constructing fuel cells at a plant close to Detroit. They will also go toward GM's joint development with heavy truck maker Autocar Industries of a line of hydrogen-powered cement mixers, garbage trucks, dump trucks, and other vehicles. Additionally, GM and Komatsu have formed a new joint venture to produce mining trucks that run on hydrogen fuel cells. Although the idea of hydrogen cars has been around for a while, the market's recent growth has been spurred by technological developments and an increasing need for eco-friendly transportation options. Nonetheless, there are still significant issues that prevent the widespread use of hydrogen-powered vehicles. The smooth adoption of hydrogen refueling stations in the mainstream car industry has been hindered by various factors, including the high cost of manufacturing and the absence of infrastructure. The following video explains the current problems faced by the lack of infrastructure of hydrogen-powered cars. And similar to how buyers are afraid of hydrogen because of the price tag, companies are afraid of hydrogen for the same reason. The cost to construct just one refueling station can amount to around $2 million, which is way more than your average gas station or electric charging station. The remarkable range of hydrogen-powered vehicles is one of their main advantages. As opposed to EVs, which require frequent recharging, hydrogen cars have a long range between fuel stops. Therefore, they're a great choice for those who frequently need to travel large distances or take long trips. Hydrogen-powered vehicles also have a rapid refueling time. A hydrogen car can be fully refueled in a matter of minutes, which makes it quite useful, especially for people with hectic schedules who can't wait long for their cars to fill up. Before continuing ahead, make sure to subscribe to our channel as we continue with the latest advancements in the hydrogen car sector. Remember to like and comment on this video if you found it entertaining. Let's return to the video now. Hyundai Motors Group revealed a new concept car called the Vision FK at the Hydrogen Wave Forum. This concept car is like nothing we've ever seen before, with rumors of either being a Hyundai or a Kia model, which may make more sense as the concept is based on the previous model of the Stinger. Now, that's not the only thing worth mentioning. Statistics show that this car can potentially reach 0 to 100 in less than 4 seconds and can travel a jaw-dropping distance of more than 370 miles. Even if electric cars currently rule the passenger vehicle market, the discussion at CES 2024 has shown that automakers are still interested in hydrogen fuel and its potential to help the industry move towards decarbonization. Numerous hydrogen automobile projects show diversity in the future that will be appropriate for consumer needs. Today, many nations and manufacturers are aware of how hydrogen has the potential to green our planet. Despite all the recent advancements, it may seem like hydrogen cars are the ideal go-to choice. However, the reality is quite different, as the attention that hydrogen automobiles currently receive is far less than it should be. The idea of utilizing the world's most plentiful resource to power an emissions-free vehicle with a far smaller overall environmental impact deserves to be highly valued. The focus on environmentally friendly power sources has caused the automobile industry to shift towards all-electric vehicles, but hydrogen power isn't receiving nearly as much attention. Regretfully, this implies that there are currently only three automakers selling a single hydrogen fuel cell car within their ranges, making them pricey and scarce. Vehicles that run on hydrogen fuel cells have the potential to be a major asset in our transition to a sustainable transportation system. Continued innovation, funding, and industry and governmental cooperation might make hydrogen-powered cars a practical and popular choice for environmentally friendly transportation. The efficiency and capacity of fuel cell systems can be further improved by cutting-edge technologies like artificial intelligence and quantum computing, opening the door to a more environmentally friendly future. Would you buy one if you had the chance, considering the promising future of hydrogen-powered vehicles? If so, what would be the reason? Let us know in the comment section below, and we'll see you in the next video.